Put all these sad in the water. <laughs> Welcome everybody to Infamous Fishing. I am out here with Cornflower. We are in chase of like some big things. blues. I hope you enjoy this video. That's how I caught people that went in bait today. They're worried. That he's like, man, I got my cast net, but I'm worried I ain't gonna be able to find no shad coming down the river. <laughs> and look, it's crazy, but with this tide coming in as hard as it runs, all them shad we went through, come daylight, they'll move all the way up to that next boat ramp. Ah. That's a little one picking it up, carrying it. Like it. I've had some of them big ones, you think it's a little one, just tap it a couple of times. Then uh huh. Bam! <laughs> it slams down, and you were thinking it was a little one. <laughs> I usually don't even pick them up. The, they grab them, they're trying to set the hole. I'm like, man, don't even touch it until that thing bends over. You can't get it out right hole, then you grab it. Pull back one time as hard as you can. And I'll try to watch that one, though. Now, folks, when fishing for big catfish, you're going to have to weed through some of the littler catfish. Most of the time, when you're fishing those big, when you see on the fish finder those big blobs of yellow, you, you want to catch like, the yeah, fish that are trailing behind. No I knew he was little. Those are the ones little. that you want. Most of the fish that schooled up, they usually don't bite. But sometimes you get those little ones that you got to get through. We ain't been out here that long. Little ones up here. All blue cat. I mean, what are they? That's 21 foot, so they're 10 foot thick. Holy. Damn, I wish I had a striper like that. Shit. <laughs> oh, there we go. There's the end of it. And I know they're blue cat. I'm gonna um, toss this rod right in front of that tree. If it feels like it's only two or three foot of water, just drag it out some. Okay. I said I can't reach it. <laughs> Camera going. I had a guy get on the boat one time. He, man, you ought to gotta get some new reels, man. They were all covered in the shad blood and shit. I was like, man, I just bought them about six months ago. <laughs> <laughs> Alright folks. So cornflower setup is 40 pound Berkeley Figure big one. game and two rods with 60 pound power pro right. braid. Definitely with an 80 fish. pound eagle claw leader and using tiger rods and pen reels that's the setup nothing more nothing less i think two ounce of lead two to three ounces of lead that's the biggest blue cat i've ever caught in my life i feel this one this ain't no little one it's not a giant damn cat <laughs> this is a workout <laughs> yeah you will get a workout Come on, don't get off. How long you go? Ow, God, he's stuck right through my foot. Damn, he's so bitch. They didn't get your foot, toe, did oh. it? Take that off, see how bad it is. Oh. 
Sorry. <laughs> Camel still going? Yep. Oh, there we go. Oh, he really hit it down. It came up, he let it go, and something else hit it. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> <laughs> well, I got steel toes on. That's why I put them on. Bad incidents with catfish, man. Good. That big one, man. Well, if I catch one bigger, I'm gonna take a good ass picture. It's still, he's on it finally. That's from last year, boy. Ooh. Wayne yeah. Edwards was on a boat with me and about a 10 pound went in there and broke off. And then he took 90% alcohol and dumped on it. Man, I was sitting on the side of the boat, eyes rolled back in my head, he <laughs> laughing at me. He said, does it hurt? Does it hurt? I said, does it hurt? Oh, man. I'll tell you all about pain, it hurts. <laughs> this don't hurt that bit. I'll tell you. What I do notice about the blue cats, uh -huh. like the mud cats or the channel cats, you get stuck by them. It's like instantly infected, red swelling uh -huh. up. Um, the blue cats, very rarely does it seem like it gets infected. Yeah. Hurts and stings and burns for a little while. Oh. piece on this one. I'll throw this one off the side. Yeah, there's a Already. Already. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. There we go. Here you go. Oh, I got you. I'm going to get you on video on this one. <laughs> All right. We, we just threw this one out already hit. Just threw it out. Make sure I get this video. You. No, I didn't. I just wanted to make sure I got you. Oh. Oh. Don't help that I'm short. <laughs> oh, yeah. Going good. Oh. In that workout. Ha, 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 ha.
<laughs> Don't we call that one? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I wasn't even pulling that hard. Blue cats. All over. There we go. Got it? Oh, you want it. I got it. Got it. Stay on fish. Big one, right there. That's the big one. Yeah, you can tell it on that big boy. Don't be right your spot. I said, dude, do you realize how many fucking catfish are in that river? But not to mention, like, I said, with the way I look at it, because I pull up somebody's where I want to fish, I'll go to a spot I haven't fished, and damn, they probably will end up landing one, you know, big one or something. And it would have never happened if there wasn't somebody in my spot. Yeah. So I try to look at it as positive. Though. about circle hooks, they, they hook themselves. Okay. Yeah, that's <laughs> Look, now that's amazing because he ain't even hooked. He was just holding on. Huh. He was just holding on to that right there. Holy shit. couldn't get out there's no way that one with the with the bird with it was like messed up oh yeah oh shit Man. Is oh, no. still there? I don't know I couldn't I had it yeah. 
cat one on see what it's on. Oh, he's falling. <laughs> so you've doubled up too. I think he's a dolphin. <laughs> that might be a good one. He's falling like crazy, come on. You hear him pulling a drag? They blow at 30 mile an hour. He ain't come up yet, he's still pulling. Give you my camera, man. I need this. Give me your favorite. No, you hold him right by the handlebars is the best way. Either takes him, yeah, grab him like this. Sit your phone right on him. Yeah, and I'll pick it up. I hold him right there. Okay, he's heavy. Oh, shit. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Holy shit. <laughs> he is heavy. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one there. Holy shit. <laughs> I knew that'd be a good way away on the screen. I heard that drag. I told you when you hear the drags. When you... Come on, straighten your tail out. Thing. There we go. Come on. Come on. Tail straighten out. Oh my God. Turn it this way. Go and do it. Well, folks, that concludes our video. I enjoyed myself fishing with cornflower. Got to catch my PB blue cat 50 pounds. Got to put my PTSD at bay. 
I can't wait to get back out there again with we'll him. Get, we'll get flat sooner or later. I'm just getting ready to well. retire. So stay tuned, like, and subscribe, and follow for more videos. Y'all have a great one.